this conversion problem may look intimidating, but you can do it! Let's go! We have to change kilograms per centimeter squared to pounds per inch squared. So what can we do? First, we need to identify what conversion factors will help us to get from kilograms to pounds and from centimeters squared to inch squared. So we can look up in any conversion chart or table those conversion factors. One kilogram equals 2.2 Pounds. So this conversion factor will help us to get from kilograms to pounds. So that's good. Another conversion factor like this. One inch squared equals 6.45 centimeters squared. These conversion factors you can find in any conversion table or a chart. So let's go. The first step is write the original measurement as a fraction. Let's do it. So, 23.6 kilograms over, what number do we have in front of centimeter squared? One. So, over one centimeter squared. The next step is write the conversion factor as a fraction to, to cancel the original units. Let's start with kilograms. So, we are going to use this conversion factor to get rid of kilograms. So, I have kilograms on top in the numerator. Where I will put this one kilogram here? I will put it in the denominator to cancel my original units, right? And then I will put 2.2 pounds on top in the numerator, 2.2 pounds. Look, all I'm doing is I'm taking this conversion factor and plug it in in such a way, I am plugging, plugging it in in such a way to cancel my unwanted units. How do you know you're doing it right? You cancel the units you don't want. We are left with pounds. Look what we are left with. Pounds per one square centimeter. Where do we want to go? Per inch squared. So we will get another conversion factor, this one. And we will plug it in in such a way to get rid of square centimeters. How can we do it? Centimeter squared is on the bottom in the denominator. So I will put 6.45 centimeters squares on top so that my original units cancel out. Oh, it feels so good to cancel things out. And I will put one inch squared here on the bottom in the denominator. Now let's look. We got rid of kilograms. Yes, very good. We got rid of centimeters squared. Very good. What we are left with? pounds per inch squared. And now we can do the math. So we are going to multiply our numerators. So let's get the calculator and let's multiply. So 23.6 times 2.2 times 6.45. So I got, let's write it here, 334.884. What do we have? Pounds, right? Remember the units over. 1 times 1 times 1 over 1 inch squared, right? And we can round it to the nearest tenth. How do we do it? We look at this number. This is our nearest tenth, right? This is the nearest tenth. We look at this number. And since this number is greater than 5, we round the number to the left. So we will have 334.9 pounds per inch squared, right? So we will write here 334.9 pounds per inch squared. Did this video help you with this conversion problem? I hope you feel a little bit better with conversions. Follow the steps, do things slowly, and you will be on the right track. I wish you success in your studies. Keep up your good work, and I will see you in my next video.